First tonight at 6, 11 Alive is working to get you the answers you deserve. Residents reached out to our Bo Beth Yates about a broken gate at their apartment complex. They believe it's inviting crime into their community. So Bo Beth started investigating and found out there's been a significant rise in robberies and car thefts at that Atlanta community. Tonight she is holding the complex accountable in a story you'll only see on 11 Alive. Imagine getting a notification from your car that something isn't right. And when you come down to check on it, you realize you're being robbed and you get face to face with the burglar. As I approached this vehicle, I stepped over here, passenger side. He points a gun at me. I spin this way around this car. Asar Al describes the scary moments he confronted someone attempting to steal his car early Monday morning while it was parked inside the garage at MAA Centennial Park apartment complex. The gate hasn't been fixed um, and it's just open as if it's we're in the public streets. So intruders could come in at any moment and mess with whatever vehicles. Constant uh, break-ins, they haven't done anything, haven't had security 24-7. El showed 11 Alive police reports, showing he reported someone breaking into his car four different times in the past year. All happening, he says, after the gate broke. They attempted to break into this vehicle as well, but this has, a, it's a double glass, so the glass on the outside is cracked. APD crime data shows L isn't alone. Since May 2020, there have been 27 other crimes reported at the property, mostly robberies, motor vehicle thefts, and burglaries. So we went to MAA to get some answers. They told me they're frustrated too, that it's taken so long to fix the gate as a vendor struggles to get the parts. They've now made the decision to replace the gate completely in the next six weeks. But for L, the fix can't come soon enough. Once I get it two times, three times, four times, it's a little crazy to where I had a standoff with this dude. Either one of us could have gotten shot. In addition to the gate, we're told this camera, which is right above the site of the attempted burglary, is not working. Officials say it's new and they're currently working to connect it. Bobeth Yates, 11 Alive News.